Kelly Reed to Vaga, to Vaga, uh, Nathaniel to Vaga. Uh, now Olu. is that Olu? Olu, Brendan Olu, and Owen Milburn. The captain is uh, Jacob Buis, Keenan Mead, then Victor Paul, JJ Garrison, Collie uh, Connell, and then Walker Smith, and then Carlos. Flutie Clark it is, and Shane Parkinson, and there'll be more players on the sideline. Here's a run for Kalamunda. Nice pass too. It was Roberts. He found Shawdor, and Shawdor will go in under the post, and it's an early try for Kalamunda. They lead 5-0. 5-0 over Perth Bayswater, and uh, the try scorer Aidan Shawdor came off Kalamunda Roberts from their back line, and Kalamunda lead 5 points to nil here at the Pat O'Hara Reserve. It's Bomber Thompson with you for LMSC, a match the of the day against uh, Perth Bayswater and Kalamunda, and Kalamunda with the first try. And the kick will come, and it will be in fact Yatu. Uh, and I don't think he'll have any trouble getting this one, Hayden. No, this mm -hmm. one should be fairly straightforward. So a quick mention if you've just joined us. 40-3 to three in the Colts, Perth Bayswater over Kalamunda, and if you were viewed in for that one, uh, we do apologise. We had um, electrical difficulties out here at Perth Bayswater. There was no electricity, um, but we, we rectified that problem. The replay of that, we did film the game with referees' coverage, and the replay will be on the internet tomorrow. So the, the Colts boys or anyone following the Colts, they can view that tomorrow on YouTube. And the reserve grade clash, well, a day they want to forget here at uh, Perth Bayswater. They went down 70 nil to Kalamunda. A very entertaining game, and the man of the match there, uh, in our opinion, Graham Malcolm, he was absolutely brilliant for Kalamunda. He'll earn himself a beer tonight, uh, Malcolm. And uh, here's the kickoff for Perth Bayswater. Just four minutes in, Kalamunda lead. Seven points to nil. And I just need to uh, pen in a few things here. Another strong run from number three for Kalamunda. Offload. Varnish for Kalamunda for a knock on. No. Kalamunda making. The handling skills have been really good from both grades today for Kalamunda. Top run with a knock on. Early, early lead for Kalamunda is set in good place. Varnish is over for the knock now. <coughs> As we go, Weir about to distribute. Good defence from Bayswater though, they're holding their own in this game. Tackle. After a dismal performance in the uh, reserve grade, unfortunately. Going down 70 points to nil. Walker Smith with the tackle. Where to distribute again? Yeah, certainly a day they want to forget, isn't it, Hayden? Oh, 100%. But they need to, to, to look at the replay tomorrow. They need to. Here's a nice Parkinson. run by a Perth Bay. That's Parkinson, is it? Yep. Kicks to himself and he's, he's off. Oh, oh just, just finds touch. Gee, he's got some speed, the boy. New to the club this year, Parkinson. It looks like he's an athlete. Yes, certainly one of our standout players throughout the season so far. The line's his centre. Where did he come from? Queensland. Queensland boy, eh? Queensland Premier Rugby. Yes, well, whether it's Rugby League over there or Rugby Union, it's rugby and it's very big. Now, we were discussing earlier our, um, our ladder. And while this throw ball comes into play, Calamunda gain the ball. We'll... Um, we just want to go back. He finds touch just past the 22. It'll come up. So, Hayden, thanks for joining us today. Um, you had your first call in uh, reserve grade with me, and uh, it was a pleasure to have you on board, mate. It's uh, it's great. You're no a proud member of the um, Perth Bayswater Club. I was going to say Perth Bayswater. I'm looking at the board. <laughs> That's why I stopped and paused. So, now, Cottesloe on top. Yep. Um, they've played 12 one 10. They're level with Netherlands, but uh, of course, of course, our percentage has seen them lead the way uh, with 10 wins over Netherlands. So the top two look strong. West Scarborough a third with nine wins, and UWA they went last week 13 10. That was our match of the day. That was a beauty. I said that earlier. And then and then outside the four you got Wanneroo, Palmyra, Associates, and then Arcs. Now all those four sides look strong. Wanneroo, Palmyra, Associates, and Arcs. So they you know that top eight can really really feel and here's Kalamunda up today against your boys they're just outside of the eight yep. so they'll be aggressive and your boys will be strong um, second last on the ladder but they they play like they don't deserve that they've only had two wins and, and five games to go five games to go, yeah, games to go. and just outside of course Jundalup Coastal Cavs 
and as four I said, Perth Bayswater and then Curtin at the bottom of the ladder. So the top four, Cottesloe, Netherlands, West and UWA in fourth. They look very strong. Wanneroo just outside that four on percentage. They're equivalent to UWA uh, with eight wins and Palmyra with seven along with Associate seven. Now there's a scrum here on the 22. So what's your thoughts of that ladder? They're just having a look at it. Well, the way it works is from UWA down to Associates, there's only three competition points, so a win for any of those teams Ball. today means they're straight into the top four. Um, Calamunda as well, one point off arcs in eighth place, so they're fighting for that eighth spot. Um, that's the position they want to be in at the end of the season. It, ma it makes that top eight look very close, doesn't yeah, it? Yeah, no, it does. Sorry. And arcs are only six wins, but they, they've they had um, some, good, they, yeah. some good strong wins there, yeah. so they'll, they'll be working hard to get up there, the... Uh, Harris-style arc. Actually, what you'll spot is Calamunda actually have one less win than the Lions, but they've been reigning in the bonus points all season. So when they're not scoring tries, they, they're losing close games. So certainly a decent team this season. Bayswater are the same, unfortunately. A lot of close games. Now, a penalty here for Perth Bayswater on the 22. So they'll bring the ball back in. Victor Paul took the kick, and he sent it up to about 10 metres out. So see if they can... Um, See if Perth Bayswater can get on the board. Can get on the board. They're seven nil down with uh, eight and a half minutes. This is our Premier League clash this afternoon. I'm old school. I still call it first grade. Sacks good. And um, leave it red. That's it. It's it's our top. It's our top grade. Oh dear. We're here for LMSC and we're at the Pat O'Hara Reserve here in uh, Morley, home to Perth Bayswater. What a bad pass. That was uh, Milburn with a with a scrappy pass. Advantage is over. Up the wing. I think he's gone out. He ran out. Just stepped over the line. Unlucky. As the ref calls advantage over. He's stepped across. We've got a couple of spectators blocking our view bomber. Yeah, they, uh, the boys are having a few beers here next to us. And, sponsors uh, stay down at Perth Bayswater. We've invited all the sponsors along, give them a few beers to thank them for their support for the season. It's great to see. And, um, you know, there's an old saying we had in, in the media, working in the media yeah. and working in advertising. Sponsor those that sponsor you. Yeah, exactly. So here's the throw. Perth Bayswater. Oh, low. 50th game for Bayswater Yes, today. you said that. I was about to give that a mention when he got the ball, but you beat me to it, and, and I applaud you for that. Nice pass. Nice ball work there by the number 10, Victor Paul, and he put it on to uh, Canelio. Now they're up to the 22. Perth Bayswater looking to retaliate with a five-point deficit. Trips good play Actually, on. seven, that should say, shouldn't it? That's a turnover ball. Calamunda now spreading it wide again. They love to use the wing, Calamunda, don't they? So they've gained, they've gained ground straight away through uh, Kuatu and then up through um, Rangi Hutu. Nikau Rangi Hutu. I hope that's how it's pronounced. Calamunda. No advantage, number seven off your feet, slowing it down. So it's a Calamunda penalty. Oh, Our referee oh, this oh. afternoon is uh, Justin Foster. He's laying down the law. And Calamunda will kick for touch on their own 40 and send it up the field into the Perth Bayswater half. Not a bad nudge. So, yeah, Owen Milburn, 50 games is... Uh, no, Brandon Olo. Oh, sorry, sorry, where are we? Yeah, Olo, number six. Yeah. Is that right, the number six? 50 games? Seven. Oh, they've... They've switched shirts, they've switched sides. Oh. I've missed that one, sorry. Oh. Yeah, you're killing me. <sighs> you're killing me. Anyway. <laughs> it's all right. They're playing the same position. Blood. They do. They're yeah. both flankers. It's fine. Good so, so of all those games, 50 for Olo. Yep. Um, all those games uh, nice. been with Perth Bayswater? Yep. Or did you yep. start it? Yeah. 50, 50 games for a Perth Bayswater, yep. So, it's, uh, if Not I'm correct, that's about three or four seasons? It'd be, yeah, it'd be three or four full seasons. Uh, I think he's been here for longer. Um, he's had the odd season away. But um, he's been an integral part of the team for quite some time. He's well known. Yeah. Um, well liked amongst. Well, he makes he makes his presence felt out there for and Perth Bayswater. He, he, he is a strong he's a player. Big big man. A very strong man. Um, so you'll right, you'll see when he takes a carry, he, he rows, so six, runs seven, it with one, one, one arm. And you've you've, right, you've yep. played alongside him a few times. Oh, not quite good enough for that yet. But nah. <laughs> we'll see how you go next yeah. season. Crouch. Work in progress. We might get you Four. in as a commentator, Hayden. Yeah. Oh. I'm but you've got, you've got to play first grade to, to make the oh, commentary, to, <laughs> to get <laughs> into the media. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so they've won the scrum, your boys. First Bayswater with it up to the Show 40. Go from Paul. Victor Paul, that was a hard hit there by the Calamunda defence. 
It goes out yeah. through the back line. Hamish Mead. Yes. Carlos Flutie Clark. Flutie Clark with it. And they're going to take him Off out. Boat. He releases the ball. Well done. Flutie Clark getting in there. Comes out through Mead. Goes through Paul. Paul finds the number three, Veach. Veach goes to ground. Advantage, 10 red. Back out. Oh, playing a bit close there, Ola. 10 offside. So Ola was a bit... He was a bit afraid he needed to get through a bit quicker. And... Uh, 10 red offside. The play didn't work out. But uh, they've gained themselves a penalty through yep. offside. So the pressure gained there by Calamunda, and they lost mm -hmm. it by a penalty, uh, probably caused that uh, the error. Yeah, But uh, it's played in their favour, so they get the penalty. And uh, the kick, Victor Paul, the kick for touch. What's Looks for about 15 metres. It's a flat one, but we've made some metres. Bayswater pushing back into Calamunda's half. Hopefully it points on the board this time. That's so to bring it in is uh, Buist. And I assume they're brothers, Jacob and Ben, are they? Yes, so we've actually got two lots of brothers on today. The Mead brothers and the Buist brothers. So Tavish Mead is the correction at number 11. Okay, and who's the oldest in the Meads? Uh, I believe Keenan Mead's the oldest. Keenan is so the oldest. And, and what about the... Um, uh, Jacob Buist is the oldest. Buist, well. Buke, and he's, your, he's the captain. Yep. More experienced. Yep. Okay, so... Play on. Ball was out. Ball was out. So I think we might I'm not, have... I'm not sure. I, I saw it. It's, it's back on Bayswater's side. Yep. It's a scrappy play off the line out. Some, with the someone on the sideline over there dropped a ball, and I wasn't <laughs> sure who had it. Oh, go. here he goes. His 50th game today up to the 22 with a get out of my way. Perth Bayswater in control. Good defence. Oh, it was offside, though, from Kalamunda. Kuatu. Yeah, well, he was offside, but um, strong tackling. Good defence by Kalamunda. Hey, guys. Fifteen. Too early. Shot. Points. Listen, listen to us yell out, get out of the way. So here we go, Bayswater. Thanks, mate. Yep. Looking like yeah, they yeah, might so line the up a kick here. It's not about when the, when the ball so they're down 7-0. Three points, three points would help. He came back. So and he is. So he's going to take a kick. Is, um, Tavish Mead. He's actually was the kicker from the Colts game. Oh, he's a brilliant kicker. Yeah. So we've we've seen him today. Gee, didn't he have a great game in the Colts? No, he does. So he's stepping up again today. He's helping out the club. Now, what, what players... Can you tell me... Is Tavish one of them? What players are, are uh, um, Western Force Academy players? Is Tavish... Is he? He because might be. Mate, looking at him, he deserves to be picked. If if there's a scout out there, have a look Watch at this, this boy. Have a look at that for a kick. No, so his kicks are phenomenal. The guy can land them from 40 and still sail over the post. So. Well, he, we saw that today. Yeah, for the Colts game. Yeah, and um, you know, fantastic. under 20, seeing him do that in under 20s is fantastic. So Tavish Mead with three points there, seven points to three. Callum under lead, Perth Bayswater. We're here at the Pat. O'Hara Reserve, our match of the day for LMSC. I'm Bomber Thompson. Hayden McGregor joins me uh, on the sidelines uh, in the commentary, and it's a pleasure. Hayden's a, a, a member of of the um, Perth Bayswater Committee and Club, and a strong and proud member too, I say that. You speak with a lot of pride about your club, oh, I'll, give, I'll give you that. Oh, how's that intercepted? What a take from Calvin. All I was uh, inches away from catching it. Stolen from his hands. And that, that was absolutely brilliant there by Shortall. He's our try scorer so far. Ooh. Here we go. So Calamunda really working the ball wide again in this grade. Well, good defence there by Perth Bayswater. They laid on the pressure. Barnage. They've got it up to the 40. Oh. On the side again, I think. They released the ball, but he gave the advantage to Calamunda. Gee, that was, a, that, that was sad for Perth Bayswater. They were working hard there yep. to try and retrieve the ball after that intercept by Shortall over Brandon Olo. Yeah, he plays a big part. This is my second game for the season for Perth Bayswater, and Olo is certainly one of your best, um, as well as Owen Milburn. They, uh, yeah, Milburn's another young player as well. He's one of the youngest players in the team, and he always has an impact. Yeah. Really yeah. good That's ball carrier. That's the center, guys, so I just need you really to step off. This carrier. is the middle. He always makes metres, hits the game line. Yeah, certainly an asset to the club having a kicker like Tavish Mead. So a kick from Keenan Mead at the half. Giving Bayswater space. Return. This is uh, Shortall again. He goes to ground just over the halfway line. Picks it up. Weir. Sends it out through his backs. Finds Simpkins. Good, Good defence there by Perth Bayswater. They're up to the halfway line. They're losing a little bit of ground, but they're slowly but surely through a minute. Good offload from there from Kalamunda. 
chipped it through. Parkinson to retrieve. Outside. Nice kick. Yeah. Outside the 22 was the call from the referee. So, so what's he done yep. now? Happy. Yep. So the ball will come back into play through um, Buist. Oh, it's a touch ball. There you go. <coughs> With a try for Shortle for Kalamunda, they lead seven points to three. 17 and a half minutes gone in our first grade clash this afternoon. Good throw from Buist. Olo picks it up. Beautiful play. Looking for their back line. The Kalamunda defence strong. The Perth Bayswater take it up over the halfway line. The ball's released. Good carry from Smith. Flutie to Buist. Buist the captain. Flutie Clark, there he is. Jacob Buist. He's a strong player, isn't he? Yep. Over 100 games for Perth Bayswater. Keenan Mead with it. Sends it out to Victor Paul. Victor Paul goes to ground. Comes back up through Mead. Going onto the far side of the field. When we get on that far side of the field, it just deludes the vision slightly. So we've got to Varga with it. Tries to send it up. Now the Kalamunda defence is good. They've kept them back into the Ooh. half. There's a good hard hit. Yeah, that's... That's Knock an accidental on the side. Koyatu with the uh, Tiara Koyatu with the uh, tackle there for Kalamunda. What an absolute hit. cruncher. Wasn't it a beauty? Nice Bone breaker that one. It was. You could hear the thunk, the yep. thump, should I say. Rattled the camera, I think. And Mama. they've they've gained <laughs> and short all kicks for touch after uh, gaining a penalty, I was going to say. Up to the twenty two, Hayden. So I'll they'll bring the ball back in through Ransfield. Zinzan Ransfield. Guys, I need you to step to the left. Step to the... So Kalamunda with a good opportunity here to put more step points the on the board. The Haven't spent a lot of time actually since they scored that first try, oh. have they? No, the, well, the, the, their attack's been good, but the defence by Kalamunda has been very strong. So Weir picks it up now for Kalamunda. So they lost a bit of ground there through the defence of Perth Bayswater. Comes up with it there, Tapara. Tapara goes to ground. They're looking out, sending the ball out in the far oh, side, Shortle. Black offside. He's been everywhere so far, Shortle. He's been fantastic. <laughs> number 10 and number 12, black offside. And the Perth Bayswater committee looking after us today. We're right next to the tent. And uh, they've just passed us some, some sushi. Uh, no, nah, no beer. <laughs> I'm already slurring my words. <laughs> <laughs> So there's so the, kick. the boys know. Now that's Weir, I think, with the kick. Outside channel, just yep. take that extra step back, all right? Jake, Weir same with you guys. That outside channel, ago, just take that extra step Is back that right? right? Yeah. So we've got um, a lot of players crossing clubs. Yeah, they. It's a bit they, of a family affair, this one. Well, you said before, Kodik. Uh, Calder Cup. Calder Cup. Third grade, yep. He moved up to Kalamunda, of course. He yep. lives in Kalamunda, so he, he just pretty much went home. Yeah. Um, so he had a few. You can't blame that. No. Because, you know. If you're playing reserves and, and you don't have match payments, you, you've got a lot of travelling to do. It's a lot in petrol. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Good run here from It's Calum. nothing nothing against the club. No. So here's Kalamunda in attack. Up through Simpkins, looking for his back line. Parkinson. Nice defensive tackle there. Who was that? Shane Parkinson at 15. Good tackle, yes. Goes, finds Tapara. In turn, finds Ransfield for Kalamunda. Short hook calling for it. A real battle going on between the forwards now. Stay there, seven black, stay there. Hold there, black. 21 minutes gone. 7 3. Oh, he's, he's big hecky. He's a big strong. He's had a, he's had a few good tackles. Goes out through Koyatu and out through the wing. Now, up. defense have taken Kalamunda out. <laughs> One of the players said to the ref, he went straight in my lap. You hear everything, don't oh, you? Oh, yes. Love a bit of feedback from the players through the referee, Mike. I heard one a few weeks ago, the best line in any sport. Go on. He's been doing it all day, ref. Ah, you're kidding. <laughs> <laughs> Haven't heard that one before, Bomber. He's been doing it all day. <laughs> so here's the play. Comes up Reed with it. Oof. And kicks for touch. And we'll bring it in again. So Bayswater are unable to clear that, making no. a distance. So Callum under five out with the throw. That's the centre, big gap. Watch here, I think they're going to send it out to Short Hall. He's looking for it. Um. 
Line out throw for Kalamunda. Here's What's the throw. Here? Oh no. I'm off. So uh, yeah, it looks so like the hooker is actually getting Time's some off. attention from the physio. So while well, his hands are tied, he can't throw the ball in, unfortunately. I'm back on. Kalamunda ready to throw. A good attacking opportunity here. Clean take, Bayswater not contesting. Maul! Kalamunda trying to, and they're getting a bit of momentum here. Here we out go. Seven, Looks like they might be getting through. Where with the ball. Kalamunda lock, looking to use some space. Good step. A few drives. Simpkins, Better think. come back! Oh, he's lost it. Ooh. And the referee's found there a penalty. Ah, well, Perth no Bayswater release. didn't need a penalty there. No, 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 no back they here. Gotta go five. Clear release. So they could. No, they're taking the tap and they're going no, for it. He's gone back. And that's uh, Ringy, Ringy Hatu. So Kalamunda strong here. Perth Bayswater holding their line and another line. penalty to Kalamunda. All such grass there. I think that was a try. He has. He said. Mm. Yeah, it's touch Ball. grass. Yep. I know. thought it was a penalty. Nice. Well, he, his arm was slightly uh, waved. Justin Foster needs to work out his... Yeah, his hand signals. Prove his signals. Because it looked like a penalty to me, but it was actually pointed straight up, so therefore it's a try. So it's 12 points to three. <laughs> and the try... Mm, not cool. Well, I thought it was uh, Nika Rengi, Rengi Hatu. So we'll give it to him. Um, if I'm wrong, I do apologise if you're watching the replay or those at home. I'll have, I'll have a look for you. We'll find out. Yeah, we'll have to find out who, who who scored the try. It did look like the number five, Nick Cow. And here's the kick. Koyatu with two from two. So two or two from Koyatu, and it looked like Rengiatu with a try. So Shorter with one, Rengiatu with one. It's 14 points. That's not right. No, that's... Hold on. Did they get a penalty? No. The no, scoreboard take... says 16. That's incorrect, unfortunately. So it's 14. I'll just um, let our producer know. Hmm. Yeah, just um, just let Alan know that the scoreboard says... Our scoreboard says 16-3. It's, in fact, 14. So here's the kickoff. Parkinson's going up. Well taken by... Hukama, Hukamu, Hanai Hukama, or might be hu Hukamu. Rectified, thank you, Scott, our cameraman, assisting our producer. The boys are flat out. They've been very busy with the electrical problem here at the Perth Bayswater. The try hasn't come up yet. No. Yeah, I'd say line. Using the Rugby Explorer app for those out there. Excellent app this season. Gives you live updates. Yeah, well, it looked like Ring Ring R2. We'll pay it. We'll, we'll give it to him, eh? Yeah. Nice on offload. Now, that was a great we we onto Tapara. Yep. Straight through. The defence was strong. They're on the 40, and they kicked there for Koyatu. Parkinson together. He didn't find touch. Parkinson sends back. it up the field over the halfway line. That's a nice kick. He finds touch. Taken by the physio, good hands. Quite a good distance on that one, actually. He's got a solid probably 35, 40 metres on that kick, Parkinson. Kalamunda to throw. So Kalamunda getting another try ahead, which is good. That'll give them more confidence moving forward. Now here's Early the throw. <coughs> Kalamunda with it. Taken there by Tupu. Looking for the back line again. Nice pass. Short haul. Strong. Good hit. Good hit there by Flutie Clark. Weir comes into the rescue. The number nine. Sends it to Simpkins. Oh, straight through the Simpkins middle. straight through the Tupu. And Sila Tupu up the field. He's ringing again. He goes to ground. Earth base water defence strong. Silla Tupu still down on the ground, actually. Getting some attention Nine now inch high seven black. <laughs> We've got a stoppage now. Referee Injury Justin there. Foster giving everyone a breather so the medics can take, give attention to 
Mark's yeah, it'll good, be a penalty for a high tackle, seven back. Yeah, he was running through. Made a daring run and he's heading through like a train. I think he's actually done something. He's, he's pulled up on his run because he looked like he went low into that tackle. Yeah, he's, he stepped mm. to, to pass. Yeah. yeah. You know, when you, you go through yeah. and you step back to pass the ball mm. to someone coming on and then the players cleaned him up. Yeah. He's looking in a bit of pain, unfortunately. We might have a bit of a stoppage here. Up Good in. time for Bayswater to get some water in and, and have a think and try to figure out how they can get some more points on the board and keep this game close. Certainly putting in a better effort than the reserve grade today. And your club looking after your sponsors here today mm. with our match of the day. So although he's going to penalty through... Yeah, it's all good. Take your time. Time's off. No, have a go. Have a go. Right. So it sounds like Calamunda might be taking the kick here and taking the points. Okay, we'll just wait for him to leave the field and then we'll put time back on, right? Number 11, Aiden Short, who looks like he wants to take the kick. Time's still off. Um, Tupu being helped off by the medic and some support staff. We wish him the best. Uh, hopefully it's nothing too serious, and he's back out next week for Kalamunda. Geez, moving slow. I'm going for the line, I, I think that's the rain coming in oh, now yes. as well, I think. What are you going to do? We oh. did have okay. a problem last week. Gee, it oh, poured last on. week out at, um, out at the stadium um, and at uh, UWA. Ah, yep, yep. It was teaming down, and um, the rain got into the ah, camera. And we <laughs> lost picture for a little bit there, but... Uh, the boys worked very hard and brought the pitches back. It was only out for a little while, but I hope that doesn't happen here as the rain comes down. Oh, it doesn't, yeah, it doesn't show up on the monitor mm. um, that it's raining. Uh, and the, and the um, aperture, of course, on the camera, which allows the light in, works extensively. And Koyatu, is it? Number even 10. though it gets, mm. gets dark. So he's coming for the kick, has he? Yep, Koyatu, number 10 for Kalamunda, lighting up a kick for three points. This would give Kalamunda a 17 to 3 lead if he lands this. Straight out in front, probably about 30 to 35 metres. Here's the kick. He's taking his time. There it is. And oh, he's got it right up the guts. Sends it out to 17 points to nil. Koyatu, three from three. 17 to 3. Uh, 3. Yeah. I said nil, didn't I? You did. It's not reserved. 17 to 3, that's right. Yeah. <laughs> Come on, Bomber. Sorry, mate. <laughs> I, I usually look at the monitor and I didn't. I didn't even look at anything. I just assumed. And assumptions don't make the world go round. My wise man once said. I think. <laughs> you can, with you the can tell I've worked as a journalist, <laughs> can't you? There's the kickoff. Oh, he's oh, beautiful kick. Up again. Contest, and knocked on. on. No, play on. Oh, what are we doing here? Now, he's called fair contest, but the Kalamunda boy knocked it on. So I'm what happens sure. there? He's called a fair contest. So is it just... Hard to say, Bomber, because he doesn't have his arm out for an advantage, does he? No. Well, I'm a bit, I'm a bit no, you that, don't but... the lead. Anyway, Mead's come up with it. He's sent the ball up just past the 40, and the Kalamunda defence is strong. Six to three, the score. Kuriatu with three from three. Short or with a try, and I did say ring R2, but we're not sure about that. We'll have to check that yeah. at half time. Oh, yeah, we'll get information into that. Substitution for Bayswater. Number 24 is Jed Trevon. Now, I've just looked at ring R2. I've called him ring R2. Oh, I think it's ring Hetu. Hetu. I think the W might be might be silent, so we'll call him ring R2. That sounds a bit more. Nick R. Ring R2. So. Anyway, he's got a mention. And he's earned it. Stand up. And that's the main thing. That's why we're here. The to, to praise good rugby. And it's uh, it's certainly good this game so far. As we're come up to the 30, 33 minute mark. It's, we're inside the final 10 minutes of this first half. Certainly. Out here at the Pat O'Hara Reserve. Sorry, Had. So it's certainly a tight game. Boy. Even though the scoreline again doesn't bike. reflect that. Um, no, we'll, we'll see a good second half by Perth Bayswater, I think. There's the feed. Through Weir. Excellent try. He's found a penalty. Excellent from Bayswater. 
Ah, so so the push there paid in favour of Perth Basewood, and they're happy with that, your oh, boys. Yeah. No, they're loving it. Here they come. The whole team's coming in. So <coughs> now they don't they don't want a penalty goal. That well, it looked like we might have an injury here as well. He don't look good, does he? No. So he's been helped up by the Bayswater player. What number is it? Number two? Is it number two, is it? It's Ransfield. It is. So another stoppage. Callum Underboys are taking a hit tonight, today, sorry. They're really getting, um, the medics yeah. are getting their, their day's pay today. And it looks like Tavish Mead might be lining up another kick for Perth Bayswater. So this will put, if he gets this, this will put... And he's a great kicker. We've oh, already, he's an excellent kicker. We've already pronounced that. So this will this will put six on the board for Perth Bayswater, well, which will uh, make their second half comeback look a lot more gettable. Mm -hmm. Smart play from Bayswater as well, taking the points on offer, just letting the scoreboard tick over and not getting caught up. You know, trying to score a try off every play. <coughs> and certainly their heads are up as well. After watching reserve grade, and it was a lot of lot of moments with the heads down, and well, let, mi let, mixed with flashes of brilliance, wasn't it? Of, co of course, but let's clarify this. Let's let's clarify that what I said. Um, you do do that. You tend to do that. A try goes bang, 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 bang. Yeah. You drop your chin. Yeah. But when I said it, five minutes later, Perth Bayswater went up oh, the field. Mm. They put it to Calamunda. We're yeah, talking oh, reserve no. grade here. Yeah. They put it to Calamunda, and they lifted their chins up. But even though they went down seventy nil, they were outplayed. Yeah. Um, and they knew that, but um, it was courageous in defeat. Here we go. He's been clapped off the field, so he's up on his feet, which is good to see. Well, that's that's not good for Calamunda. They've just no. lost two crucial players. And Mansfield, um, he's played a big part with his defence, mm -hmm. defensive tackle so far. 30 minutes in, it's time off. So we'll be looking, when we come up to the 40-minute mark on your monitor at home, if you're, you're viewing this, um, it will read 40 minutes, but I think we're looking... At the moment, about two or three minutes stoppage time out mm -hmm. on. Our clock continues too, just incidentally, Hayden. Our clock nice. continues, and yep. uh, the referee, you do hear him say, stop, stop. Right, time back on. Here we He's go, just time back on. Time back on. So here's Mead with the, uh, in the scrum. for the kick. Shot called. And he's just over the 40. He's a fair way out. I'd bang That's this one. Man. Well, put him money on it. you want to be a good kicker to kick from there. Oh, and, yeah. And Nine. he's probably the best we've got. He's yeah, stepping he's up from the Colts grade and he's been given the kicking tee, so. Big future in the sport. Certainly. A proud Mead family, a big part of Perth Bayswater. Bob Mead, former president, so. He'll be here somewhere today, will he? Yep, he'll be in the sponsor's tent somewhere, having a few beers, cheering on the r relatives. I think it's his grandkids. Good to see. Great to hear that. Here's the kick. Oh, he just sliced it, it, but he's got it. Flags up. Oh, look at that. Well, your money went on well. But I'll tell you what, he would have been 10 to 1 on to miss it, even though it was 40 out. But he scores it, Mead. And uh, yeah, he certainly knows what he's doing when it comes to kicking. So he's 2 from 2. And that makes it 6 points for Perth Bayswater. 17 points to 6. Two tries for Rengihutu and Shortal with the first try. Uh, and it's 17 points to 6. And here's the kickoff. So they trail by 11. 35 minute mark on our monitor. Ooh. Oh, big hit. And that is a penalty. He got him in the air. Oh, I don't think he did. Look, he didn't do it on purpose. The no. Calamunda boys have got a bit frustrated. Yeah, he's gone down in a heap short all. He looks step all right away, though. Step away, step away. Ulu has um, Ulu's come step out away. smiling, of course. You do that step in defence. You've got to come yeah. out smiling. Um, I think when he looked at the player, he did... There was a slight oh, look of guilt, mm. Mm. but right he's away. taken out a good player in Shortall. And Shortall uh, looks all right, though, away. thankfully. Yeah, he's come Seven. up. I think Justin Seven. might... He Just, might, get, he might yeah. get the binny. Yeah, so Fo Foster's Eleven. having a chat. Step, I've asked you. The whole team go back. Jack all was walking back. back going, no, no, it's all right, it's all right, but he wants to talk <laughs> to him. <laughs> no, look, no, he's got his hand in his pocket. Team, so oh, he's copped a card. And it's a team one as well, unfortunately. So he's in the bin. Shane Parkinson was done the first time round, so unfortunately Olo in his 50th. Um, and he's talking to the team as well as he's walking out. <laughs> he's going. He's they, they might give him a red shirt bomber. <laughs> <laughs> he's, he's taking right. his time, isn't he? He's walked straight through the Calamunda side. He's a bit of a stirrer, isn't he? 
Yeah, he's got a bit of, bit of a history behind him, Olo. Um, well, look, look, but he hits hard. When I you wanna, hit hard, I want to clarify that when he hit that player, when he hit Shortle, then mm. he, you could see he didn't mean no. to. Oh he, no, no, it was just he, he was attacking yeah. the ball at first, yeah. and then he just Ooh. played. But here's a run. Who was that? The number twelve, brilliant Simpkins. He's had a few good hit-ups today, and he's just laid the ball straight in for another try for Kalamunda, yep. which takes the score in our first half. 35-minute mark, it'll be my assumption, with uh, stoppage time. <laughs> there you go, the referee just six said six and a half. half. Yeah. So that takes the score to 22 points to six, and that makes the task a little bit more harder for Perth Bayswater. Yeah, no, right. a bit unlucky there, Bayswater, um, after getting that three points back on the board and getting back in the game, having to hang on for another five minutes, and... Unfortunately, a yellow card, and then Simpkins just dancing through the line there. It was an excellent run. Yeah, Dated when you, through almost untouched as you, well. Your player gets sent off for a card. Yeah. It's it's disheartening. Oh, yeah. And they all sort of looked it's at a, each other. Yeah. They weren't ready there, and uh, they, they that's that's where the word discipline comes back mm -hmm. into it. You've got to stay in, in the game. Yeah. You know, it didn't look good. All I knew what he did wrong. Mm. Um, he's wearing it. He's on the sideline having a sit-down. And uh, he'll think about what he's done, and he'll come back on, and, and I'm sure he'll um, put in a real good second half. So here's the kick. Koyatu, was it, with the kick? Yeah, it's Koyatu. Here we go. He's had a good kick in today, and oh, there's another one. So he's four from four. We're talking about Mead as a good kicker. He's he's a great kicker. Koyatu and Mead. Four, four from four, so we've got some good kicking out there. And kicking plays a big part in rugby union. 100%. Three points for a penalty. And, of course, two for your try conversion. Yep. So, um, reserve yeah, if grade, if, um, if it wasn't such a blowout, they would have been looking looking to some kickers, Kalamunda, unfortunately. The one one from seven, one from eight, I think it was. Oh, um, I've forgotten his name already. M Mabu? Flick back and have a look. Ma. Kalamunda with the... Caleb Ma. Collection. Nice little offload. Oh, look at that, up the middle. Absolutely gassing Off the kickoff. That's uh, Koyatu. Yeah, Koyatu, yeah. Play on, he's released. So he's made almost 40 metres on that. And now Kalamunda into Bayswater's half with front foot ball. Koyatu Kovatu, his name is. And he's got some speed for a solid boy. Kalamunda making ground again. Up through to Para, looking for one of his forwards. To Carmel. In there with uh, assistance. We now Simpkins. with Simpkins again. There's our short -haul. try scorer. Short haul, yeah. Oh, and he's almost oh. slipped out of and that. And he's offloaded to uh, Rengi Hetu. Rengi Hetu still going. And it was back to Kavatu, was it? It is Kavatu. Oof. Trivana. And they've gained a penalty. Yeah. Quick tap from Weir. Simpkins. Going wide. And it looks like Kalamunda. Oh. Mead almost with the so intercept no that wide. Just to knock yeah, on. he's blown the whistle. And it was a legitimate attempt, so he's getting the just yeah, the knock on. Yeah, he said no no mm. advantage. So a scrum will go down. There'll be a Calamander no, feed. No, he did have a didn't go at a jack. So 24 no, points to six. Now, the, the, the TV monitor says 40 minutes, but we did have some stoppage. So yeah. I'd say we're looking at about three maybe four. 43, yeah. three to four. Yeah. He said six and a half minutes a few minutes That's back, so, try, so yeah. we're looking three and a half to four minutes. So still a few plays to go in this first half. It's 24 points to six. Just got to get Alan to upgrade that scoreboard. Calamunda with the attacking scrum, about 15 out. They've been using their, de their depth from their back line really well today. Now Short haul with a lot of good runs. Did I count? Six. It was 17, wasn't it? And then 22. So it is 24, yes, yeah. yeah it is. Yep. So someone on your school, on the scoreboard down there hasn't changed that. But no. Here's Kalamunda again, in attack, sending it out wide, oh, and great. an easiest of try. Well, let's hope Perth Bayswater come back with a better second half, and we'll just try and pick up that number. He went in wide after the they won the scrum, Kalamunda. Lulu. Referee says two and a half minutes to one of the players. Usaya Ralulu, I think, number 14, is it? So 29 points to six with a great try there. Who'd you say it was? I believe it's 14, Usaya Ralulu. We'll wait till, uh, wait he, till walks, he turns around and he shows us around. his number. As uh, Koyatu gets ready to kick. 14, yep. It is number 14. So his, his name goes on the board. That's uh, Saia Ralalu. Usaya. Usaya. Usaya Ralalu. 
There you go. We got that one right. Thanks to you. <laughs> <laughs> They've given us some um, pronunciation next yes. to the name, thankfully. Well, Sire. That's uh, Sandy did that. We thank yep. Sandy for that. Sandy from Calamonda. <coughs> so here we are. We are too with another kick. And Roe mentioned before our no, Calamonda no, reserve good. grade manager. Mm. Um, she was saying how we, we need to thank our assistants. You know, our trainers and our ball boys. Mm. Um and, and they deserve that. Uh, so a big thank you to all our ball boys and, and trainers who, you know, give their time to support Rugby Union in Western Australia. They're, they're a part of the club and they play a strong part of each and every club all around Western Australia. It's um it's a great sport, rugby. It's 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 a fantastic sport. I love oh, it. I can't believe it. I get paid my, for this. It's my religion, Bummer. It's your religion, <laughs> that's it. We're with the collection offload. He takes it up to the 30. That's Tapara. He releases. Goes out through number 19. That's Cooper Guy on the field. Oh, another and here's run. a good run. And a good tackle too. The number 8. That's Buist. Jacob Buist Captain with Lee a latch on, latch on tackle. And another good tackle there. On the number 10. Koyatu. So the score. If I'm right. The score's now 31 points to 6. And Koyatu with the mm. kick successful makes no. it. Back hole release now. 31. I thought he missed it. I could be wrong. We'll keep the game going while we check the Explorer out. Kick through. Meet to collect. Off to Flutie. Hey, did that guy get the kick? Hey, guys. Did that guy get the kick? Manage. So, advantage to Kalamunda. So, he did get that kick, Hayden. Just, we did turn away from it. Oh, okay. So, anyway, Kalamunda up to the 40. So, it's 31 points to 6. They've kicked away Kalamunda. So, with the uh, end of the first half coming to a close, advantage for the knock. they need to review their errors, Perth Bayswater. And here he is. He's had a great first half since, he's, since coming on. Kovatu. Oh, he's going through. Is that Kovatu? No. Number six. Matt Number Berry, six. I think. Oh, Berry, is it? Matthew Berry. Yep. Matthew Berry scooting through. Around the blind side, untu almost untouched for a try in the corner. Well, the last five minutes haven't looked good for Perth Bayswater. No. 14 players on the field, it's always hard, Bomber. Yeah, yeah, it, it makes a big difference. It opens the defence up, doesn't it? That's yep. half, guys. So the referee's called half time, so the kick will come. Oh, and here's a. Someone's left their shopping at home. And they're wandering past the game. <laughs> <laughs> this could be a tough one for Kwiatu. So that's Berry with the try. Yep. He's got about half a foot in from touch, so this will be the toughest kick of the game, I think. Kwiatu, it's pulled out. Two flag. He's five from five so far. It's 36-6. Here's the kick. Probably his hardest yet. He's only one less than a metre in. Oh, nice kick. Oh, yes. No, nah, just missed it. Just no, to the left. It's off. So there's half time. So five from six for Koyatu. Oh, as we go to half time, we're back. Hayden, you're on TV, mate. Oh. Your first time as a commentator, <laughs> and it's great to have your company. Hayden Cheers, McGregor Bomber. joins me. I'm Bomber Thompson. Mm -hmm. It's half time here yeah, no, out at uh, Morley at the Peter uh, Pat O'Hara Reserve, home oh, yeah. uh, home to Perth Bayswater. They lead 36 points to six. Tries for Shortle with the first one. Uh, Rangi had two, three quick ones from Simpkins, Rolalu, and Berry with that try. Five from six for uh, Koyatu and two from two for Mead with the conversions. Mm. Perth Bayswater yet to score a try, but they go into half time and thinking about their mistakes because that mm. last 10 minutes, oh, definitely cost three them. tries, two conversions, yep. that's a lot of points on the board. What, what looked like a very close game up until that point. Yeah. And like you said, when you lose a player, 
yeah. uh, due to you know due to the card, it, it makes it very hard. Mm -hmm. But anyway, it's getting a bit dark here. You mightn't see that on uh, on your monitors at home. Thanks for joining us for LMSU. This is our match of the day out here at Morley, our home of the Perth Bayswater Rugby Union Club. They play home to uh, uh, the visitors today, Calamunda, and uh, it's 36 points to six. We'll take a break and we'll come back shortly, Hayden. Sounds good. <laughs> Okay, welcome back. Bomber Thompson with you for LMSC. And it's uh, 
Home game today for Perth Bayswater. They take on Kalamunda. It's 36 points to six. If you've just joined us, this is the second half. Let's go down to the field now. Hayden McGregor about to sit back next next to me. Almost took out the commentary table. Sorry. Okay. He's, um, now, Hayden, it's uh, it's your day off. You're yep. usually on the field, but um, you're spotting an injury, so you're in the commentary, and it's great to have your company. Thanks, Bomber. And this is the second half, mate. You trail by 30 points. Yeah. So Perth Bayswater need to lift it here. Calamunda look very strong. Here's the kick. We need to score. Is that oh, short? It is short. Yeah. Sends On. it up. Just past the halfway line. Nice take. Mead with the take. That was Mead, was it? Walker Smith. Now that's good. Quick quick hands. Mm. Send it out to the field. Trying to create an overlap, as I said earlier. Yep. Flutie again inside. Flutie's Back been off. good. Flutie Clark. That's good. Before he went to ground. And coming up with it now is... Berry, who's a try scorer for Kalamunda, scored a good try. Every try is a good try. Oh, straight up the. Oh, middle. here he is. Uh, that's uh, Ring Hutu. Oh, nice ankle tap. Nice from Parkinson. Yeah, Parkinson, great tackle on Ring Hutu. Kalamunda still with the ball through Roberts. Weir. Roberts in in, in fact finds Weir. Weir sends it through. I'm just trying to pick up who who that player is. So Kalamunda up to the ten. They lead 36 points to six. First two minutes of the second half, and they're in attack. Kalamunda, they look strong. Through oh. Roberts. Is that Simpkins again? He yeah, Simpkins, through. he's strong. Get out of my way. He loses the ball. Now, there was an advantage here. Yeah, knock on. So, Perth Bayswater gain the advantage. Get out of jail free, I think, for Perth Bayswater. Yeah, bring him up. Great camera work, uh, camera work by our cameraman, Scott. He's right on the ball today. The crew were working excessively for I LMSC. I think that's Olo returning to the field as well. Local media services company we are. And we bring the match of day each and every Saturday to you through the internet. I'm Bomber Thompson joining you again. We thank our supporters. Electrical Unlimited up there on the screen. Big thank you to them for being a part of this coverage. Also a sponsor of Perth Bayswater Rugby. They are, are they? Yeah. They are indeed, yes. They're probably next door enjoying a beer, and so it's well earned. And we thank them for their support, as I said earlier. Sponsor those that sponsor you. That's a nice tackle by the Kalamunda boy. That was, in fact, Play the number 12. Down. That was Simpkins. Oh, the ball's just skidded out here, and I think that's He's a come try. up with it, and it is a try. Ref's given it. Number 13, Caleb Roberts. Well, he's been very strong in the, in the last, well, the first... First two carry. or three minutes of the yeah. game, Simpkins has been everywhere and he gains oh, himself two tries. Roberts. Oh, Callum Robert, Roberts. I said Simpkins earlier. I do apologise to uh, Callum, Callum when you're watching the replay tomorrow. So Roberts with his first try. Opportunistic there from Callum under. Unlucky for Bayswater. Yes. Yeah, well, dangerous oh, spot to lose the ball. Oh. And it's... it's, the, it's Oh, well, Part of the game where Bayswater needs to score first, I think, to really get that half off. Five from six. We've got 41. Koyatu. Oh, he missed one. He missed yes. that last one, yep. didn't he? So here he is. He's five from six. Looking at six from seven. Even missing one. Six from seven is a good record for the day. He's had a couple out wide as well. Yeah, that last one wasn't, a, wasn't yeah. an easy one. He is an accurate kicker. Very good one of the best well. there is, and he sends that one through. Yep. So six from seven for Koyatu. And that takes it to 43. So I think that's got away from them now. It looks like all Kalamunda. Mm. Kalamunda 43. Perth Bay's water six. Tries for Simpkins, Ralalu, and Berry in the closing half. Uh, Rangihutu with a try in the first half as to Shortle. He scored the first. Um, and then Roberts, Callum Roberts with the try. Oh, poor kick off from Bayswater. And it'll go out, but hasn't made 10, so it'll be a free Go kick. Back. A free kick, a penalty. No, On it'll the be halfway, a scrum. They'll call a scrum, of yep. course, yeah. Do you want the line out? Yeah, yep. Oh, no. Okay. So play the line out. They've opted to play the line out now. Oh, so, th so the ball goes out, so they, they got that option. Yeah. Line out to the halfway. Okay. Line out at the halfway as well. Okay. So they're hoping to win the line out. So they're looking more confident with the line out than they are with the scrum. Well, we had Bayswater had that pushover penalty, didn't they, in the first half? 
Trump. Right, so that's why they've probably done that. But they've won the ball here, Calamunda. Where? They're on the halfway line. Out through their back line. line. And there's Roberts again with another good carry after scoring that try. Sends it up to the 40 and he releases. Through to Para. Oh, nice offload there to uh, Cooper Guy. Cooper Guy goes to ground. They're still bringing it out wide. Finds Shortle. Shortle in turn found Kuadu. Oh, Kuadu oh. sent it into play and he's offside. Accidental offside. offside. Yeah, accidental. <laughs> he caught the ball and said, why have I got this? Yes. Knock <laughs> on. Offside. So they're all it. walking back. Yep, we've had a couple of those today. Kuadu's having a bit of a... He had a bit of a smile about that. Okay. Got a couple of players. So now. here's the here's the kick. So Keen and Mead for the kick. A couple and of players he, down on the field. He's aiming for us. Time off. That injury's yep. in the way now. So so time off. Yep. Time so off just under six minutes. First time yeah, off. He's in the way of the line now. So we'll let the injury get sorted. Walker Smith, right? 13. Good. So right on six minutes. And your referee is Justin Foster this afternoon. Time's still off. Time's doing still a good off. job today. Yeah, he's he? been accurate, yeah. hasn't he? He's been very accurate. The refereeing's been all good. He's very direct Time's still as off. well. Yep. Time's young, still off. young Mike Ward in the Colts game today. Very good refereeing. Mm -hmm. He was right on it with the Colts. And um, and there was a bit of aggression out there on both sides. Very strong. And a lot of passion too, which is good to see young football. Um, well, it carries through, doesn't it, to the senior grades. Well, and it, you know, it really builds. When they, when they won a scrum or won a penalty and... Uh, you know, won the ball, caught, yeah. forced an error. It was all, yeah, and, and, and it's so important. Mm, mm. It's so important. And if the coaches are teaching them that, then I applaud the coaches. Mm. A credit to them. And it really builds the um, atmosphere of the game as well. It makes it really entertaining. It certainly does. Yep. Yeah. Time yeah, when a, when a person scores a try. Mm. And the whole team comes around. And fantastic, isn't it? Quick shout out to Daryl Stops from the committee. Feeding the commentators. That's the shot. Bayswater with the ball. Going wide. Chipping through. Parkinson looks like he's... Oh, he's just missed it. Oh, it's gone out. Yep. Looking to collect on the run through. Fast man, Shane Parkinson as well. He would have been off. So it'll be a Calamunda ball. They'll bring the ball back into play on the 40, that of Perth Bayswater. So they're in their half. And the score line has certainly gone out of proportion. 43-6. Yeah, up until that last seven or eight minutes of that first half, yeah. it looked like it could have been a close game. Yeah. But Bayswater were in it. They lost to Ulu, one of their Black valuable players. Berry, Gee, Berry with an offload. That was an amazing offload. Advantage is over. And he's chipped it through. And it was Cooper Guy who came up with it. Oh, and it's another and try. And in turn, 17. number 17, that's uh, Ruha Tafare. And that's, apparently that's how you pronounce it, yep. Tafare. Ta Tahiri Tafare. No, I think that's the pronunciation. Ah. Yeah. Ta ah, taf Tafare uh, Ruha. Tafare Ruha. There you go. Tongue twister. Another one on the board for Kalamunda. It's over 50 now. Starting to run it out. Yeah, we're just... Let's just hope that... Bayswater keep their heads up. Yeah, keep the chin up. They deserve a try, Bayswater. They've worked hard. They had a lot of good opportunities in the first half. I think... They just need to get back down that end of the field, really. Ola will be waiting to come on very shortly. He's been back for five minutes. Oh, he's back on, on is he? Yep. I was just about to say, because <laughs> it's up to eight minutes, I'm thinking he yeah. should be back on by now. So no, he <laughs> snuck back on while you were doing a shout-out for um, LMCS. Yeah, thanks for your... Uh, SC, sorry. Thanks for correcting me. Make, right. Making me look stupid. I like <laughs> that. I make myself look stupid. Anyway, here's the kick. He's been brilliant today. Six from seven, Koyadu. He's gained, uh, he's gained a lot of points for his team. Someone's got to keep you on your toes, Bomber. That's it, mate. And there's another one for Koyadu, Hayden. Right. Seven from eight. So... 14 points from him. Yeah, well, 14. One, tally. one... Oh, no. Yeah, all, all, all conversions, weren't yeah. they? No yep. penalties. So yep. 14 points he's gained of a 50-0 uh, lead. So that's a great effort. 50 to six again. 50 to six. 40. We've scored points this game, Bomber. 44 points. 40 po 44 point lead. Anyway, here's the kickoff. It's for Shortle. Uh, not Shortle. We're Damn only in number Mead. 11. It's Mead. I saw the 11 anyway. So it's Mead. Mead kicks off. Calamunda with possession We're again. Berry with the run. So the defence from Perth Bayswater comes strong up onto Calamunda. To try back. and keep them in their half. And here's a oh, kick. Shortle. Yeah. Indecisive. He stepped back. He kicked. That was touched. So ball comes down. Down to Flutie. 
Flutie Clark. Flutie Clark, he's looking for support. Good tackle by Ralulu. Milburn with the carry. First base water. Mead with the kick again. Comes down. Koatu with the run. Up to the 40. Kalamunda with possession. You've got to keep him up here, Perth Bayswater. To prevent the kick. Mm. They're running the ball out to the wing. And that was Berry as well. Oh, that was... Oh, we've taken out a ball boy as well, I think. That was a good hit. Look out Play for on. the ball boy, someone hard? said. Played on. It's a quick pass into Flutie. It's out to Parkinson now. With Col Connellau. Here's a chance. Perth Walker Bayswater. Smith. Up the wing. That's Smith. He Parkinson. sends it out. Parkinson again. He started the play. He goes down, releases. Chance for Perth Bayswater. Inside the 22 in attack. Through Mead. Mead goes to ground. Looking for the release. Perth Bayswater attacking. They're putting it to Kalamunda. Can they put a try on the board? Get him into double figures. It's 50 points to six. Perth Bayswater putting it to Kalamunda. They've dominated this game this afternoon. Robert's not up. rolling away there from Kalamunda. So penalty. <laughs> Will he run the ball? Keenan Mead with it. Sends Olo. it out. Oh, Olo's he it. He's dropped the ball. Five, there's two knocks. First off black. Ah, uh, two knock off. Well, they didn't need that. Unlucky. Bayswater with a good opportunity there. So the scrum will go down about 10 metres out of Kalamunda's try line. But they will get the feed, Kalamunda. So a chance to bring the ball out of their own half. So Perth Bayswater, gee, they look good there. Uh, they really put it to Kalamunda. And the scrum will go down. He's on the 10. So weird to feed the scrum, I assume. Crouch! Here's the play. Bind! Referees Justin Foster laying down the rules Six. today. Here's the feed. Where to feed? Ten metres out. Good pushing by Perth Bayswater. And they've gained a penalty for it. Well, they worked for that and they earned it. Quick tap, quick. And he scores. Mead. Keenan Mead puts the first try on the board for Perth Bayswater. Well, they did that with their forward pack. Very, very strong, the forwards. Winning a penalty off the scrum. Keenan Mead comes up with the ball. Takes a quick tap. Bang. Try. 50 points to 11. No, we're not there yet, Cambo. Well deserved too from Perth Bayswater. <coughs> Kept the pressure down that half of the, half the field. And it's paid off. And they've finally got a try on the board. Tavish Mead now lining up. Two from two this afternoon. Convert his brother's try. Family affair. Family affair, yes. Good to see. Gives the kick. Oh, he's a good kicker. There it is. Flags up. He's a good kicker. Good technique as well. And it's really good to see the young guys lining up with such good, good start to their careers. So three from three for Tavish Mead. 50 points to 13 in favour of Kalamunda. But Perth Bayswater with a good tacking play on Kalamunda then. Sending the ball up the field. They lost possession with a scrum but then gained it in a penalty. Keenan Mead went straight in. So off a shoulder, play on. Perth Bayswater with the ball again. There's a good hard defensive tackle there by Berry for Kalamunda. It's Parkinson. They slipped out of a tackle. Finds Flutie Clark. All right, he went out. Flag. No, it's touched. For Kalamunda with the throw. They'll be confident. They've had a good line-out so far. 
Bayswater would like to hold them out for the rest of the half, I'd think. They've leaked a few too many and they want to keep it keep it back to zero. Good play there from Calamunda. A little one two at the front of the line out. And Olo in his fiftieth game. Seven first man in. Managed to get a win a penalty for Bayswater and turn it over. Arriving player. Now that was no. was it not releasing? No. Yeah. Failed to release. Mm -hmm. Holding on. That was Cooper Guy. So, what turned out good play? Mm -hmm. It was brilliant, wasn't it? Excellent, excellent line-out play. And then Guy went up the field. He's aiming that for our cameraman. Yep. Cooper Guy went up the field and he re he didn't release. Lines the centre. So. Anyway, Bay first Bayswater to bring the ball back up. Mm. If we can get another try, it makes the scoreboard look a bit better. So Buist to bring it in. jump from Bayswater. Poor play out wide though unfortunately. Conaleo with the carry. Perth Bayswater in control on their own 30. Defence has been strong by Kalamunda. Flutie Through Clark. Flutie Clark. He's over there now. He's everywhere. No hands! Leave it! Victor Paul running at half I think. Oh good run. Good oh, play on to Olo. He's off. Oh! Built it again. Yeah, but the, I, it was the defensive tackle by he Weir. Tried, he just the tapped the ball, I think, or tapped his arm. Mm. And Olo just lost it. Gee, it was a good play too by Olo. Mm. Now, good run there by uh, Kuvatu. Kalamunda moving forward. He sent the ball up for Kalamunda. Now, here's Roberts. There's a good, hard defensive tackle. On a ring he had to. And it was Charlie Reed with the tackle as well. That was amazing. And Weir slicing through. Oh, he looks good, Weir. Nice tackle. The number eight. Jacob Buist, the captain for Perth Bayswater. No, it wasn't. It was no, the it was six. Milburn. It was Milburn. Owen Milburn. Out wide, Koyatu. Nice uh, biggest, dummy. Biggest dummy we've seen all day. Leave it now, no. Play that was. <laughs> so it comes up through Weir. Oh, oh, they've knocked it on. That's the knock on. So this will be this will be a scrum and a feed to Perth Bay's water. Justin Foster out there directing the troops. Taking good control of the game today, actually. Good to see a young up and coming refs going through the ranks, and making it to okay. the premier grade. Oh, lockdown. Bayswater with the feed. We've got a stoppage Time now. Off. Referees tool time off. So we've got one of the Kalamunda boys stumbling yeah. off field. Okay. So clock's right. 17 okay. minutes, 18 minutes. Um, yep. Just give me time off. Medic. So we'll add a few minutes. What's he going off for? Now he's called the, the trainer in. Referee. Okay. okay. Oh, so a head okay, clash. So yeah. Yeah. You're worried about head? Can't take any chances. Keeping the medics on their toes as well. Referee's not letting anyone sneak anyone on and off, so. When we restart, it'll be Bayswater so with Matt, the feed. So, 17, doesn't come back. Okay, yeah, he doesn't come back because they, they don't have a head assessment on the sideline, so he's not coming back. Okay. All right. So, the referee just advising that that player can't return. So, I'm just to you guys. Baseball. So, yeah, concussion rules Time very very strong these days, isn't it? And so it should be. Time back on, so we'll probably add an extra minute at the end. I think we've had a f there's been a few so far, just a, a few little ones, so we're not far out. I'd say Crouch. it's about, uh, look at about 16 Ball. and a half, 17 minutes. So. Anyway, here's the scrum. Six. 30 metres out, Perth Bay's water to feed through uh, Vic, uh, Victor Paul. Yep. Advantage. Bay's oh, water scrum very geez. strong today. That's the third penalty, I think, today for the base of the scrum. Wow. The front row will be happy. Well, that's a that's so a big there, yeah. turnaround for the scrum oh, in the big. second half of Perth Bayswater. So Tavish Mead to take the kick. They'll be happy with that. The boys will be fired up. Sends it up the field uh, about the 45. Just past the halfway. LMSC here this That's afternoon, our match of the day. If you're viewing us through the internet, I'm Bomber Thompson and Hayden McGregor joins us here 
on the sidelines with the commentary. It's a pleasure to have Hayden with us. He's a Perth Bayswater committee member and a, and a player who's uh, off the field today through injury. And your boys have got the ball, Hayden. Yep. Up, up to the, the 40 through the big fella. That's Garrison. So he's played reserve grade. Yeah, Come he's on. A, he had a good game too. He Strong. Look at this for play. Perth Bayswater Smith. looking good That's in their amazing. backs. And a break there through Smith. He goes to ground. There's a the release. Turns it back. Milburn with the carry. And he's going through as well. All right. Nice play. There's the release. Perth Bayswater. Another try. Up Last. through Mead. Good offload from Tavish Mead. Yep, and here's uh, Camburis with it. Off now, Fred. Fast play from Bayswater. They're really making Callum under work on defence. Nice pass that out to Parkinson. He's had a great second half so far, yeah. Parkinson. Fantastic. So has this guy, Flutie Clark. Offloads, Ooh. try. Walker Smith in the corner. Third. Walker Smith, number 13. What a great try. A good run from Carlos Flutie Clark to set him up there in the corner. An excellent offload. Bayswater will be happy with that sequence of play. They've worked their way into the half. and Gee, how the good did they look then? They when looked the, brilliant. When they're on fire, they're on fire, Bomber. Oh, they, just that first half where they lost, when they lost that 10 yep. minutes going into the second half, yep. three, or, three or four tries went in, and, and with, yep. the tr with the conversions, of course, because yep. they got one of the best kickers in the business in Koyadu. <laughs> Um, it's it's just brilliant. Yep. Speaking of the, one of the best kickers in the business, Mead. So Mead's lining up a kick from the same spot as Koyatu in the last half. It's good to see kicking duel going between these two. Oh, they're both great kickers. A credit to them both. Credit credit to Rugby Union. But how old's how old's um, Tavish? I believe he's under 18, 19. He's under 20s. What a future. And he's already playing so well at this grade as well. So he's got a lot of years left. You, you kick and play footy like this or rugby like this, and he's, oh, he's got that oh, he's too. he's got that out the guts as well. How does That's he do amazing. it? I'm going to applaud that. That's brilliant. Tavish Mead and the Bayswater crowd, let him know it too. Well, the score looks great. Four from four for yeah, Tavish Mead. Yeah, yeah. Speaking um, of kicking, Kuiadu seven from, from eight. Your team. They okay, are so dominating yeah, the game, Kalamunda, but you've got to give it to Perth Bayswater. They've now started. put 20 points on the board. And they trail by 30. We're 22 minutes into this second half out here at the Pat O'Hara Reserve. Our home game this afternoon, our match of the day for State Rugby Union. Perth Bayswater, 20. No, no, Kalamunda no, lead Tackle by 30 this. points. It's 50 to 20 in favour of Kalamunda. There's the kickoff. Perth Bayswater game with the ball. Up for Olo, he's got the break. Another big run from Olo today. It just shows how valuable this player is, Olo, when he went off the field. Mm. Advantage. You know, Too early, number 19. When he went off the field in that yeah. first half. It, Too early, just timing. It was a big impact. Just timing. It was. it was, yeah. So again, Bayswater playing fast. Offside, 19 red. And Calamunda coming up too early to try and slow them down. Giving the penalty for And we're back. Anyway, the ball will come into play through Perth Bayswater, and this will be uh, Buist. Short line out for Bayswater. 30 metres out of the Calamunda try line. Perth Bayswater, if they can gain this, they have. Good clean take. Mead leading the charge at 10. <coughs> Gee, haven't they lifted their heads up? Perth <laughs> Bayswater. Release! They're playing fast rugby as well, so it's going to wear out the Calamunda defence. Mead again. He finds Reed. Ruck, no hands, Ruck. Reed with a big hit on him. Olo. Releases. Drops the Play ball. Advantage. No. There was no tackle. Boy, Archie with the carry. Yeah. He collects. He picks it up. He's dropped it. No advantage. First one's off black. Yeah, it'll come Second back. Second one's off red. We're going to scrum red. No advantage. Yes. Knock it was on. clear as day. So no mistakes here by Justin Foster. Great refereeing. He's been on the ball with all of the, all of the decisions. Very so good. too as, as all the rest today. Yeah. It's been great. No, it's now, nice. the scrum will go down. They're 30 metres out, but it's uh, a Callum under scrum feet. Are we looking forward to this one, Bomber? We are. I think we are. Your boys want to push hard, don't they? So uh, they've been strong in the last few scrums. Yep, they've looked fine. fantastic. And um, see yep. what they can do here. So we've won three scrum penalties today for Bayswater. 
They'll back themselves on this one again. So Victor Paul will be following Jack. Crouch! Boy! And the Baysy boys will be pumped as well. I've got a few tries on the board now. They'll want to really clean them out. And here they go. Feed. Pushing again. The ball. They got that ball out of that scrum quick. There's a beautiful pass. Short haul on the wing. Oh, and he's gone. No, he's put a foot in touch. True courtesy of, who's that in defence? JJ Garrison. Yeah, Garrison. So, he's so just strong defence. Just managed to squeeze short haul out. The ball will come back into play in favour of uh, Perth Bayswater. See if they can keep it in the Calamunda half and draw it towards their line. There's the play. Another no Tuck call line out from Bayswater. The tactic they've been using most of the game. It's the halt. Out through the backs. Perth Bayswater in control. Walker Smith. Up the middle. He's going. He's off he and gone. He's got Parkinson outside. He has. Parkinson. Oh. oh. The pass, the pass, pass was touched by Calamunda. Well, they look good, Perth Bayswater, then. They come fine. up with it. Here's the kick. Fine. Oh, and he's fine. He's touch sideways as well. So we're 10 metres out from the try line. Bayswater throw. Jack, his timing is fine. Are they still allowed to touch down and just going back though? Yeah. A few conversations with the referees while we wait for the ball to come in. Ben Buis with the throw. Bayswater will be confident they'll score here. Here's the throw. Vantage, knock on black. Oh, I just missed that then, didn't I? Tom Munder will come up with it. Guys, there's no advantage. 50 Focus points to line. 20. In the line out by Black. About 26 minutes into our second half. We're halfway through the second half. Well, just over, of course. Six minutes over. And uh, yeah. Tom Munder lead. So what I need from you guys is patience, all right? <coughs> What I need from you guys is... Bayswater will be confident again for the scrum. Calamunda managed to get the last one out. Bayswater have been putting them under a lot of pressure at the scrum time. We're staying down at all times, okay? We're not coming up. Referee Justin Foster having a chat to the front rows. Let's see how Calamunda handle this pressure. Bye! Here's the scrum. Calamunda defeat. See! Through Weir. Another good push from Yeah, Bayswater. good push. And, and they've come over. up with it. No, oh. the referee says no. The ball was out. So the referee has blown it up and he's starting it again. Well, unlucky for Bayswater. I, I, I don't know, right? No. They no, push, they won push, the push, the push they gained the ball. Yeah. Scrum time's oh. always a bit confusing, Bomber. Well, he never said anything then, but he gave this signal. The fingers. <laughs> Back in the day, that used to be the old um, twisting and turning. Twisting, yeah. He yeah. said they turn. He's turned turn the, scrum. the scrum. So he's pulled it out. So. Another one, boys. Another one. Crouch. Seems to be too Boy. much strength on one side. Mm. Take two. See. Too many wheat picks this morning. Too many. They're pushing again. Shouldn't push till the ball goes in. Oh, there it is. Now, Calamunda dropped the, the scrum then, the but... Mm. Let it go, it came out. Oh, Callum Roberts First. coming through. Excellent collect, and he's... Oh, he's, he's looking for Shortle, Shortle and it goes into... Well, that could have played off good for Callum Under. Mm -hmm. That would have been good play. That would have been one of the tries of the day, of oh, course. Would have been if it, if it paid off. off. It was an excellent collect from Callum Roberts. He's playing yeah. well. Solid, Certainly is. Solid, solid defender and a solid distributor. Both him and Shortle yeah. in that back line. Yeah, they've the uh, they've there, been right? extensive, haven't they? Yeah. Time's off. Yeah, we're just doing subs. So another time stoppage. Okay, who's going off for you? Well, back the referee discusses yep. subs with both teams. Okay, yep, one back on. Throw. Good. Ben Buist. Here's the throw. On the 40. Paulo wins that one. Straight away, out to the back. It's going wide. Looks good. Callum under with the defence. Conaleo, the run, good carry. Mark, no Callum hands, Roberts no hands, with the tackle for Calamunda. Vantage. On the 40. Too late, Rucks already formed. Charlie Reed with a nice strong carry again. Calamunda doing well to keep Bayswater static. Poor pass from Meade. It's been picked up. No advantage. Rucks formed. 
Referee Justin Foster. Penalty to Bayswater. So Mead will get Rock this. Formed, hands in the ruck. And we'll try to get into Callum under territory. A few so tired he, bodies out there today. So here's the kick. Oh, he hasn't taken it out. No, he hasn't. And that's... Good run there from... Usaya Ralulu. Callum under make it up to the halfway. Weir with the ball, distributing. Yeah, Ralulu, he's already scored a try for Callum under Ralulu. Short haul with an excellent kick, and it's crossed up Shane Parkinson at the back. Yeah, past the 22, all the way to the 15. Mm. Dangerous territories. Good tactic from Callum under as well. Playing a smart game of territory at the moment. The wind you can hear is coming from the referee's mic. The breeze has picked up. Here's the throw. So Buis, all they in there. Gee, well timed that, didn't he? Mm. Perfect timing. So up, up to just short of their own 22. Hey, Perth Bayswater in control. Perth Bayswater Rumbling forward. have really picked themselves up in this second half. Definitely have. It just shows you what they're capable of. Doesn't it? It certainly go. does. Yeah. So. Abuse with the carry, captain. Up to the 22. Ball collected by Buse, Ben, brother. Buse brothers both getting some carries for Bayswater. Callum under doing well to hold them out at the moment. They're not right. much of the game line. Riley Anderson with some good defensive tackle there for Callum under. Advantage. On the run. Knock on my ball black flicks seven. out. Advantage Archie over. with a chip through. And he's looking for... That ball went back. has got it and he's turned around. And now he's going for a run. So Parkinson up to the 22 now. On the far side of the field. Some big... Big defensive play by Calamunda, but in turn some good attacking by Perth Bayswater over the 22 now. And that might have been Mahan and Mason, one of the Colt boys. They'll bring it out through their backs. Ulu, where'd he come from? He was in the middle a second ago. He's picked up with the ball. Always makes good ground, doesn't he? Ulu. Bounced off three or four players. Bayswater now on the front foot. This is what they like. Good switch pass into Reed. Charlie Reed, the number four. Up to the halfway line for Perth Bayswater. They're in attack. 50 points to 20 in this second half. We're up inside the final 10 minutes. Flutie Perth Clark. Bayswater. Flutie Clark over the halfway line. Penalty advantage Over the here. shoulder. High tackle. There's the kick. Number 23. Offside. High tackle. I don't even think he meant to do that. That's just a seat belt. So there's the kick for touch. Up the field for Mead. Inside the 22. Well, right, linesman says right on the 22. Bayswater looking looking to get more points on the ball here. Viewers to bring the ball back into play, Hayden. It's been great having you on board this afternoon, mate. Thanks, I know you've enjoyed it. Oh, always good you're to try something new. Well, you're passionate about rugby mm. union, aren't you? Yeah, I love so here's it. the play. In through Keenan Mead. Rollo in the middle. Yeah. Up the middle he goes. Good crunching defensive tackle there. Counter-ruck's good. Play on. Good turnover from Calamunda, though. And that's that's Berry, Hecky there with a big hit for Calamunda. Carry from Berry. And here we go. Short hall. Yeah, they've gone out wide again. Short hall. What the hell many metres he's run not today? To touch. Man, put, a, put a GPS tracker on that, that one. Be, be Perth and back, wouldn't it? Oh, surely. <laughs> He's gone to Gerald and he's come back for the second half. He's, he's certainly done some running. About eight and a half to go. The referee with eight and a half minutes to play. Our clock says 34, so that's yeah, that's the stoppage time, two yeah. minutes. So those viewing at home, work on that. Olo with blood, I think. Looks like it, yeah. So he's taken a hit in the carry. Just blood? Okay, yeah, yeah, you can take him off for blood and bring him back. So the referee's yeah, yeah. So take him. really getting onto the middle. Because that looks today. like it's going to take a while to strap. So, um... Stoppage will return from the stoppage shortly. Well, so blood bin, um, just bring a blood sub for blood to Black bin. Seven. Yeah, the referee said um, no, so he can go off for blood and he can come back. So, so I just need a Jake. Either stitch it up or put a bit of Vaseline on it. We did nowadays. We just rub some Vaseline on it and straight back out there. It's only a bit of claret. You might, if it's a real deep one, you feel it tomorrow. But in the meantime, there's no pain. It's just annoying if the blood gets in your eye. 
new guy on. You can tell I've been there. Okay, so Mark here. Knock on into touch. Unfortunately, the times have changed. And yeah. We learn about bloodborne viruses, and that's where it's really teed off. Of course, sadly. Sadly, yeah. So here's the scrum. Over on the far side of the field, it'll be a Perth Bays water feed. They'll be confident with this one. Through Keenan Mead. He's had a great game, Keenan Mead. Both the Mead boys. Actually, he's come back on, or he's sh I've shuffled around a few times. Back on. So Tavish is back out to fullback. Flick the ball back at 10. Boy. Must be Shane Parkinson subbed off. See. Oh, 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 Looks like Callum Under putting water. a lot of pressure on the Bayswater scrum. They pushed it then. Intercept. No. Manage, knock on by Red. Yes, he did. In, he, well, it was an attempted intercept. But Perth Bayswater will come up with it. And they've got an advantage. 30 metres out of the Callum Under try line. This looks good for Perth Bayswater. Mead to Mead. He steps. Dancing around. Nice offload. Wasn't that a good offload? Bouncing off Milburn's arm, but it carries on. It's gone backwards. Flutie Clark with the carry. He's had a good game, Flutie Clark. Deserves a strong mention. Advantage now, is over for the Player now. number 17 out there. Can you help us out with the big 17? One of our Colts heads. boys helping out. Who's that? Not sure. You just recognise he's a Colts boy. Yep. I don't have a name on my uh, sheet. I'll have a look. But uh, that's why you're here today, to help us out. Doing my best. Each, each and every week. Players come onto the field, and of course they're late inductions, but it doesn't help commentators no. like myself. We don't know who they are. But um, anyway. We do our best. We do our best. Perth Bay's water with it. Need to abuse. The captain's going the for a run. Yes. Making metres too. Oh, I'm just curious of how many tackles he's had today. He's a hard worker, that one. He is. All work Flutie, great. Flutie Clarks. Flutie Clarks also had a good game. Another one. So Perth Bay's water, and they find a penalty. Tackle assess, clear release. Well, the scoreboard says 30-point lead, but Perth Bayswater are playing like it's a draw. Certainly. And that not that great to see? Mm -hmm. Clear release. Well, it's that been all Perth says. Bayswater the last 25 minutes, hasn't it, Bomber? They have. They've, 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 I've got to give it to your boys there. They've, they've uh, really given it back to Kalamunda. And, um, but Kalamunda have been brilliant. They've had some great, mm. great hit-ups, some great tries. Shortle's been good. Uh, Ringy Hattu's been really good. Um, Simpkins, wasn't it? Berry's had, a, Berry's had a good yeah. first half. Simpkins' try was great. Big Mac Hecky, mm. um, strong in defence. As we go down the field, Tapara's had a good game. Jack Weir's been everywhere. Koiatu's been good. Shortle out on the wing. Callum Roberts, he's been one of their best uh, in this half. R uh, Ralulu has been strong. Miller. So too, Kuadu. And then over, over onto the... Uh, Perth Bayswater side, the person oh. with the ball now, Walker Smith. Oh, oh opportunist. Yeah, and he's Flutie just Clark. Player. And it went uh, Oppor gone. Opportunity Play on. Big and it Callum played on. Referee says played on. Callum Roberts with the carry and a good offload. Callum under immediately in the tack. Good Back defense there by Charlie Reed. Simpkins in with the carry. Now through their backs. The pressure's good by Perth Bayswater. But Callum under in control. And that's not short at all. No. All, looks almost like Kiriopa from the reserves. I think it might have been too. Kalamunda with another big run. Well, they've gained some good good ground there. They're up to the halfway. They're up to the halfway. Over and the he halfway. He's off. He might go through. He is. I think he's going to make it. Jack Weir. Well, I was just saying he's been one of the best on the ground. And he puts that in. Well, he's been everywhere today, Jack Weir. And he gains his first try. Brings it to 55 for Kalamunda. With the kick to come, and I don't think he'll have any trouble kicking from that angle. No. Big run from Kalamunda there. Bayswater almost scoring in the one corner, and they've reversed. They've mirrored the entire field, and Kalamunda running opposite corner. 95 metres that, that effort from Kalamunda, so it's a good, good play. Good sequence, good teamwork. It's really paid off for them today, hasn't it? Oh, so has it? What? Reserves and Premier grade. Callum under play as a team. Well, you just don't see that as often anymore. Now, who's kicking this? Not entirely sure. That's number 15. Kuyatu Kuyatu? Uh, or Ku Kuyatu Kuvatu? Yeah, it's Kuvatu. Kuvatu. 
Yeah, that's him. They call him KK. And he's KK. got he's got a lot on that. She went up high, but it's not. His flags aren't going up. So, no, so he's missed that one. So he's seven from nine. The clock's ticking. Yeah, when I said who's kicking this, it didn't look like him for a second there. But um, I looked through my uh, ten by fifties, and it was him. Might have had his hair tie up the first half. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> went in for a quick right. perm at half time. Yeah. Okay, so Perth Bayswater bring the ball up to the halfway line. Where it'll be up to about a minute and a half to go, drawing to the end of this game. And what an entertaining rugby mm. union game it's been. And the score is uh, 55 points to 20. Ooh, excellent play through there, oh. and everyone's missed it. They went without the ball. There's Good the tackle from Garrison. Certainly was. Where to distribute. So here's Calamunda again Hickey. through Hecky. Another good carry. Yeah, I was just saying he's been strong. He's Absolute a strong player. Hecky. Is this, is this not our man at 20? That's uh, Malloy. Malloy. It is. He's out in the field. There's a floater. It's gone forward. Full pass. Most floaters do. That's why I said it. Full pass, mate. When they float, they <laughs> tend to go forward, don't they? Yeah, Malloy's out there. I'm not sure who came off, but... Um, super well, sub. At least Malloy is the super sub, isn't he? But he makes his presence felt. It's not through the uh, that Sconovy's up six foot four he is or whatever. <laughs> he's a big big unit of a man that one. And he's he's got that long stride. He's a he's certainly a thoroughbred, isn't he? Oh yes. So the the scrum will go down on the thirty. This should be a good one. So Bayswater feed. They'll be looking to put another try on here, surely. Crouch. Just before the uh, clock ticks yeah. over. We could be getting to our last play of the day. Seventy five points scored today, so it's been a good game for everyone. Yeah, very entertaining been most entertaining it always is when you see tries now here's good good back work play by Perth base no, he's oh, held on to it Flutie Clark just loading. holds Ooh. it Vintage. that's a, a kick play still in play Kuratu Kuratu yeah Kovatu another good run it's slinking through the Ko defense Koiatu Koiatu oh, oh beautiful pass. pass and he finds uh, Ralulu and Ralulu back again with the ball Oh, good play. Give it and to them. Simpkins. Simpkins runs And Simpkins in. with his second. <laughs> Up to the post. Well, Rilalu, Simpkins. Back Robert. to Rilalu. Back to Simpkins. Was Roberts in Roberts there, was, was he? Roberts was in the middle as well, yeah. He was in the middle. Got 45 yep. seconds. So, referee says 45 seconds. The kick will be 30. We'll get a kick off, and we'll have one more play. So, it's yeah, 60 points to 20. And uh, Simpkins with his second. It sounds like they might be taking the time with the kick to let the clock run out. So that could be just about it. Yeah, look, in the second half, the it doesn't score reflect the doesn't reflect the game not, at all, does it? That doesn't warrant a 35 45. for what will be. You've got 60 seconds anyway. Possibly a 40, or to be 40 points, won't it? And Simpkin, Simpkins kicking his own. Oh. He's having the kick here, Simpkins. Why not? Well, Kuiatu, he's only he's missed two, seven from nine, but Mead four from four. In fact, Mead, how many did he get in the Colts? We would have got a couple, I think. Oh, there's a few there in the Colts. Uh, where are we? Five from six. And he scored a try. He missed one. And he scored oh, a try, too. Yep. So he's had a big day on the field. So that's time. So just quickly recapping. Uh, firstly, our Colts, 40 points to three, 70 points to nil to Calamunda. So it was Bayswater, incidentally. Mm. 40 points to three over Calamunda in the Colts. And we are just saying, Mead... Uh, he kicked five from six and landed a try for his uh, for his efforts. And, of course, Callum under 70 to nil in the reserves. But it was our Premier League match, our match of the day here at uh, Pat O'Hara Reserve out here in Morley. And uh, a big win. 55 it finished up. No, it didn't. I think 60. it was 60. Yeah, it was 60. Did he get the kick? We're not sure. Our producer's flat out in the background. He didn't change the score, but... Um, uh, I didn't even see if he got the kick. Pull it out. I had my head in the... So... I don't think he did, no. So that, that's 60, 60 points, points to, 20. to 20 is yep. the final score. 60 points to 20, the final score. Now, let's just go over the players. Firstly, the losing side, Perth Bayswater. As we go down through the through the field, um, uh, Buist was good. Um, Charlie Reid, strong in the second half. A lot of good carries, yeah. Yeah, a good carries. Um, Orlo, always in the thick of things. 50th game for the club as well. So it was a he's good, he's good 50th out. game. And, of course, he, he, he shows that he makes his presence mm -hmm. felt because when he went off, in the first half, yep. through the bin, mm. um, 
the yellow card went up and, and Callum underscored three yeah. tries. So it was brilliant. I'm, I'm looking at Keenan Mead, uh, one of the men of the match for um, Perth Bayswater. Walker Smith strong in the second half. Mm-hmm. Flutie Clark was everywhere. Parkinson yeah, was brilliant. He was fantastic. Was yep. And um, there was a lot of good defensive play there and tackles there. Now, over onto the Kalamunda side, a, a real strong team effort. Mm. They were brilliant in their back line. Definitely. Def- Amazing. Back fanta- line. Fantastic in their back line. Uh, we've got tries uh, for Shortle. Uh, Rangi Hertu, we, we're still not sure if that was him, but I, th- I think we're it was. Confident. Simpkins with two tries. He he was one of the best on the field in yeah, the second half, player. Simpkins. Uh, Ralulu was brilliant. Barry, Barry with a, a good lot try. Of good too. Callum Roberts made his presence felt in the second brilliant. half. Um, Who's that? Ruha yep. and Jack Weir as well. And, and Jack, through at the back. Jack Weir. I did say Jack Weir, man of the match, mm, mm. Um, because he was everywhere and he led his backs beautifully. I thought he was fantastic. I don't know who you think. I'm, I'm going with Jack oh. Weir. The kicking the, the deserves a mention. Uh, Kuyatu, mm. um, Kavatu, uh, seven from nine for him. And Tavish Mead, of course, four from four. And we just mentioned in the Colts, mm. he was five from six. Yeah. He's a brilliant kicker. So a big day out on the boot with the ball, boot and ball for him. So. Jack Weir, man of the match for me. Mm. Uh, I'm, I don't what do really you think? Team effort from Kalamunda. Wasn't it fantastic? Yeah, they all they all contributed. It, they they linked up. They played like a team the whole match. Yeah, they Basically certainly did. did well. Second half. To oh, keep the, them, yeah, well, they lifted their the chins up. Yeah. They came out. They came out like I. Said,